So, in honour of FIFA 20 coming out, I'm looking at a football simulator this time round. What I'm planning to do is basically take the five Saturday Premier League matches, simulate them in this app, maybe have a little bit of a bet on them, see what happens. Um, I'm going to point out, just for disclaimer purposes, I'm not recommending that anybody bets. Betting is highly addictive. Um, I've seen a lot of people destroy their lives with it. I am an ex-bookie. So I have seen it happen. Now, first match is Leicester Tottenham. Let's have a look at how this app actually manages it. So that's Leicester. Let's click them. Versus Tottenham Hotspur. Tottenham Hotspur are... I'm going to guess Top and Pam. Yeah, that looks like them. So we hit Start Match and it just runs through. It's like watching CFAX. Anyone who's old enough to remember watching the scores update on that. Looks like we are looking at Leicester 2-1 coming into half time. I can speed this up. I can slow it down. How slow does this go? Okay. That'll take about a minute and a half probably. That'll be done in seconds. 6-4. I've got to be honest, I don't see that score happening. But 6-4 Leicester. Okay, let's have a look. Um, we're going to go through the rest of these games quite quickly, I think. So we've got Burnley. Burnley. You've got to hand it to this app. It's got the teams in it. Didn't think it would go down. Burnley and Norwich. But here we go. Norwich. Run as fast as you can. Thank you. 5-3 to Norwich. Okay. Big scores is what we're finding in this game. Everton, Sheffield. Everton. Everton. I think there might have been some copyright issues with this app. Um, and let's find Sheffield United. I've got Sheffield Red and Sheffield Blue. Let's go Sheffield Red. Uh, nice and easy one. 2 1 to Everton. Okay, that one's possibly actually going to happen, so that's beneficial. Uh, Man United. Uh, sorry, Man City. We're looking at. We've got Man Blue and Watford. Let's go right down to find Watford, Walthamford, Walthamford. Looks like the guys. One all. Now, a few days ago I'd have said probably not, but watching Norwich take on Man City, that could actually happen. So there's my draw. And then finally I've got Newcastle taking on the mighty Brighton both of them with their real names we have a look and we have 3-2 Newcastle now to place the bet so here we are sorry for everyone who's having to see my login details here we go we've got Leicester to win against Tottenham Everton to beat Sheffield United a draw with Man City Watford Newcastle to win and Norwich to beat Burnley now I am getting a pretty good odds recommendation on this. Let's do my accumulator bet. Nice and simple. I won't bore you all with doing luckies or anything like that. One pound bet is going to get me £427.50 back. Not bad if this app works. Wow. So, what can I say? This app sucks at predicting game results. I'll grant you, Man City drawing with Watford was a long shot. But 8-0. Way off. Um, actually, the only result he did get right was Leicester beating Tottenham, which in all fairness to the app, might not have been the easiest result to call, but the other four, it should have picked up something. Um, the app doesn't even really redeem itself as an entertaining experience. I mean, yes, you can simulate entire tournaments, but it's just watching scores update. Personally, I don't see the appeal. You've got no, other, no input other than picking which teams participate. Um, and with the high scoring games it's predicted for me, I don't feel like it's even trying that hard to be accurate. Um, I don't think I'm really going to be keeping this app. I think I'm going to be back to picking my bets the old fashioned way. More depressingly, back to work for me.